On the 28th of August, 1963, Martin Luther King addressed an enormous crowd in Washington, D.C. He said a lot of things, but uh, one of the more memorable things that he said was, I have a dream that my four little children will one day live in a nation where they will be judged not by the color of their skin, but by the content of their character. <laughs> um, picture, if you will, uh, say a moral philosopher or uh, just somebody who tends to think out of the box a lot. Think outside the box. Imagine that person in the crowd or listening, wincing and thinking, Oh dear, I see what you're trying to do, Dr. King. But a time will come when America will regret the way you phrased that. Why do you suppose somebody might see that speech that way, in particular with the emphasis on, but by the content of their character? A certain reading of that turns Martin Luther King's dream into something of a nightmare. It does relate, if you ask me, directly to this business of um, Jefferson rape and slavery and historical hagiography or um, hero worship or um, the very nature of why we try to act morally in this life. There's a downside to everything.